Hi guys, it's Melissa. Happy Friday. So excited. Got a new toy. Convinced Bob to help me bring it all the way upstairs. Convinced him I also needed this. <laughs> I've been waiting so, so long to uh, not only get this eight in one, but also to unbox it. So I knew these have been happening for more than a year. And uh, if you've been following me for any amount of time, you know that I have been like, eh, eight in ones. I don't know about this, guys. I don't think you really need an eight in one. The problem with the eight and ones we'll get to and why I finally decided it's time. Okay. All right. So before we get to all that, we have to unbox this thing. You have never seen a prettier heat press. I'm so excited. Wait till you see what color I got. Okay. Also it's very big. It's very, very big. I'm standing on top. I was, I'm getting messages. I'm standing on I'm on a stool back here, okay? So this is big. I'm standing, now I'm standing. I might need Bob to come help me, we'll see. Okay, so this thing, it's um, obviously heat press, it's obviously from Swing Design, and they come in four different colors. Wait until you see the one that I got. Okay, so first of all, we have a manual, yay! Eight and one, 15 by 15, swing away eight and one heat press, okay? Um, I do understand that some of these were going out, the wrong manual I understand was going out with a couple of them, but this one is the correct manual. So there you go. All right, so what is an eight and one? An eight and one heat press is a press that can do eight different things all in one. The benefit of this is you consolidate and save space. And you guys, no, I have too many heat presses. I've given heat presses away. I have heat presses stored in my master closet. I have built storage for heat presses. I have nearly gotten divorced over the amount of heat presses I have. But fortunately, this should not only save day, save some room, save my marriage. Not really, but you know. Okay, so this one, it does mugs, plates, regular flat items, and hats. So I am re the reason that I finally caved on a heat um, eight in one heat press is because I need to save space and consolidate. I need to get rid of my separate hat press, my separate mug press with all the different attachments, my two different size fifteen by fifteen and nine by twelve mini press. I, I just it's too many things. I need it all together, one spot, designated spot consolidate space. Now, the reason I finally decided, oh, by the way, here's the color. Is this fabulous? The reason I finally decided to get this one is because not only is it from Swing Design where I know I can get customer service, I've worked with Swing forever, but there is, it comes uh, with warranty. The thing about the 8 one presses, there are so many pieces. If something, there's so many electrical pieces that if you get one of the ones that is cheaper, this one is $4.99, but it's on sale for $4.49, and I put the link up top. If you get one of the cheaper ones um, on Amazon or some, you know, other places that are less expensive, you don't, specifically from Amazon, you don't, you're not going to get the uh, customer service aspect of that. It's very difficult to reach anyone, if you can ever. Um, and so that's why finally, aside from the fact that I need to consolidate and save space, because I literally, we, I wish I could show you how much space I have here. It maybe looks big, it's eh, not that big. And right behind me, this camera is Bob's office. When I say office, I mean desk against a wall. Okay, all right, so here we go. This is a plate press. What do you do with a plate press? If you want to sublimate onto plates, you use this. It attaches, it gets its heat from the main part of the press, okay? All right, so here are all of the different parts for mugs. As you can see, you can do tapered tumblers, okay, different sizes. So I just pulled out three different things, three of the eight. Plate press, two different types size mugs. There's so much. I'm Okay, this is part of the hat press. I'm gonna have to assemble this whole thing. And that's the other thing. I will do tutorials on this. Um, so I, I did get the teal because I just thought it was a really pretty color, but they also do have pink, uh, coral, and white in this same press. 
If you're not interested in the eight in one, there's also just a regular 15 by 15 clamshell, same colors. Um, there's also um, a 15 by 15 clamshell that has a pull out at the bottom, which will help, it's a safety feature that will help um, so that you're not working right under the direct heat. And if you're messaging me, I swear I see your messages, but I cannot read them because it's too far. Another part of the plate press and, okay, now I have to stand. I'm, I wish you could see me. You, you barely can. Okay, all this, oh my gosh, they give you tools. Okay, another size mug press. Oh my God. I thought I was consolidating. Okay, this is the mug press. Oh man. Okay, hold on. Mug press. Anyone else not like styrofoam? Okay, so let's. Okay, so you got that. I gotta put this stuff somewhere. Okay, now I think I need Bob. Or maybe we just need to tilt this another way. Okay, let's see how we're gonna do this. Okay, hold on. Oh! Yeah, we might need Bob. I'm not sure if he's gonna come rescue me or not. Whoa! Bob, can you help us? Or no? This is really awkward. I think I got it. Pretty sure I got it. <laughs> you guys. Let's move all this stuff. Ow. All right, hold on. I need help. Can you help us? Okay, Bob's here. Can you pull the, pull the I'm sweating. Can you pull the box? Okay, thank you. This is it? Yes. Thanks. Do you want to say hello? Hi. Okay. God. Oh, a piece fell on my foot. Okay. All right, here we go. Okay. So. Let's. Guys, I'm really, I'm really sweating. <laughs> Boxings, they're so awkward. I warned you it was going to be awkward because I knew. Okay, now there's obviously some parts we need to put together, and we're gonna. I'm gonna do that. Oh hi, Stace. Um, so <laughs> they're all saying hi to you. Oh, cool. Hi. Hi. Um, okay, so we're gonna put this together. Not now, because I haven't read the directions, but I will put it together. I'll do a, I will do a video, uh, I mean, not a video. I will do a tutorial on how to assemble this thing because that's gonna be one of the number one questions. And then we will talk about how um, you use this and everything, and then I'm gonna find a space for it. That's the other thing. Typically, um, I actually think I know where I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it on this cabinet that I have over here and shuffle some other things around and it's gonna save me so much space. That's what I keep telling myself. Okay, all right, you guys, if you're interested, these are shipping right now. Um, they have been on pre-order. The pandemic has made, as you know, everything uh, super delayed. So these have been on pre-order for several months, but they are shipping right now. I ordered this one. Um, and for those of you who are asking, I did buy this. You're like, oh, you just get all this stuff. Sometimes I do, sometimes I do. This one I bought, uh, which is why Bob was like, do we really need another press? Yes, we do, yes we do. We always do, right? And by the way, I loved all of your suggestions yesterday telling me how to sneak it in. It wasn't real, I mean, he knew. But um, my favorite was put it in a laundry basket with, the, with a towel over it. What you guys don't know is that Bob does most, almost all of our laundry. So he would have been like, there's no way you have a laundry basket with a towel on it because you don't do the laundry. Now you know my secrets. All right, you guys, I hope you have a fabulous weekend. Oh, by the way, this ship's free and includes $200 to So Fancy's Card Redemption uh, category, ca uh, collection, which is about 200, two, 200, 2,000 SVGs and fonts that you'll be able to pick from um, in $200 credit to that area, okay? All right, you guys, I hope you have a fabulous day. I'll see you soon.